Well, when the housewives get together, you know it's going to be a wild ride. But when you get together a bunch of ex-housewives and put them in the infamous Bluestone Manor, you are bound to watch something epic. <laughs> Take a look. We are destroying this town. I was on a show that you're oh no longer on. Oh <laughs> Don't be a liar. I'm going to walk away because I'm about to get... There's a lot of conflict going on with eight women. The only conflict is you. What made you think the lady was a lesbian? Her eyebrows. <laughs> can we see your eyebrows? Yes. Can I see your eyebrows? What do my eyebrows say, Brandy? Um, you... Don't, it's subjective. don't say it. Everybody don't say it. it. No, today. it's subjective, because everyone's different. You know what I mean? Everyone's different. Oh, my it gosh. Stars of Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip. Ex-Wives Club, Ex Club, Randy Glambo, Tamara Judge are here with me now. Ladies, it is good to see you. It has been a minute. It oh, has. I've seen 2018. And 2014. So it's what, nice to be back. Yes. What's it like making the rounds again for the housewives? Well, we don't really feel like husbands anymore. Right. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> You've never, you're never had okay, husbands. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. No, it feels great. I mean, it was literally, I had a year and a half, two years off. Yeah. Um, but, you know, the COVID was happening as well. So I thought, well, you know, Perfect. if I have to sit my butt down, so do you, girl. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But we are back and well, we are and bad. Bad. Than ever. Bad. bad. We're back and we're bad. bad. <laughs> <laughs> were you ever good? <laughs> me? I just, Innocent me? <laughs> well, listen, you both have made appearances on The Housewives through the years. So what's it like coming back in this way? Like, did you have hesitations? Were you excited about it? I was excited to get the call. Um, however, I was a little nervous because I didn't know any of the cast. I obviously knew Vicky. Brandy and I were in a huge Twitter war, like <laughs> oh social media gosh. craziness. Um, I didn't know Phaedra. Uh, well, we discussed it in the first yes. couple episodes, okay, so we get over it pretty quickly. But it was a little scary, yeah. but it was nice to get out of the house and do something. Yeah, I'm sure. I thought, honestly, it was like, it felt like good old housewives again. Like, it was so authentic. It was old school housewives. Yeah, because like before housewives, you would drop you at a party and whatever happens, happens. And that's what this was like. Yeah. You know, it wasn't like, okay, you sit here, you sit here, and then you guys are going to have a talk. Yeah. You oh, know? Interesting. Okay. And there's no glam, and nope. we look a mess half the time, and it's just refreshing to see that I most of the time. That. Bad hair, bad makeup, or no makeup. Yeah, no, I like that. Yeah, actually. I do too. Well, and so you're at Bluestone Manor, and I feel like I already know the question, or the answer to this question, but but how is my girl Dorinda as a host? Do you want to answer that? <laughs> um, she ebbs and flows. <laughs> yeah. Good and bad. It yeah. Depends. No, she's amazing. She, I mean, she knows how to make good TV. And that, she definitely sure. did. Yes, yes. And, and who surprised you the most in this whole getaway? Um, Brandy. <laughs> In a good way? Yeah, in a good way. I thought that we weren't going to get along. I thought we were going to fight. I thought it was going to be horrible. I thought she was going to come after me. I thought I was going to have to knock her down. Yeah. And no. We, we got along. We were the only fun ones. We actually Everyone's locked like, eyes. Oh, we're going to bed at 8.30. I'm like, we are? We are. We're <laughs> no, we're not. Tamara no, we're and I not. were like dancing. Good naked. Naked. Well, not naked, but <laughs> she was naked a lot. She's like workout queen, too. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, but I came so in, like, overweight from my normal weight because COVID. So, that happened to everybody. Yeah. All, I'm still like, holding on yeah. to I'm back to my normal weight, thank God. But, you know, Andy not. gave me, like, two weeks' notice. And I'm like, I can't lose 10 pounds oh, in two God. weeks. <laughs> Well, uh, Tamara, I'm just curious how it was being around Vicky again because, you know, as we saw on Orange County, you guys had a lot of highs and lows. Yeah. So how was this experience? On this trip? Two of you? Yeah. Exhausting. Okay. She was the Vicky babysitter. I was. She literally babysat Vicky really? the whole time. Well, Vicky had just come off COVID and she was like a long hauler where she was still sick and her lungs were still full. So she ends up in the emergency room. I'm like, I'm not going with you. <laughs> I, I'm going to go one filming without going to the hospital with you. Oh my God. And so she, she was a little exhausting, but she yeah. peps up towards yeah, the she, end. Like yeah. the last day. Oh. Yeah, the last day. <laughs> and Brandy, um, you, we see you again with Taylor Armstrong, who was also on Beverly Hills with you. Um, you know, she's been out of the spotlight for a long time. I don't know where you guys left off, where you are now. How are things? Um, you know, honestly, I didn't think we had any beef on it because I haven't seen her in a decade. Yeah, yeah. But clearly she had some pent she up emotions. You? Yeah, that she just needed to get out. So we, um, we squashed it. Until okay. last night, and we almost got in another fight. But oh you did. Well, that seems like old times, right? Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, you can catch the first three episodes of Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip Ex Wives Club streaming tomorrow on Peacock. It is good to see you, ladies. Thank you, you for having too. us. Yeah.